dry cry. Hey, Katar Bays. It's your girl, Brooke Bart, going live with the Breeze Talk and Bay Squad. Saucy Santana might have single handedly defeated <laughs> Chipmunk, aka DJ Academics. But before we get started, let's like, comment, and subscribe. Tap that notification bell so you can get all the updates and alerts. And remember, opinions are not facts. Everything we say here is allegedly and for entertainment purposes solely. So sit back, relax, sip you some apple juice or my fave, the vegan water, and let's get into the mash, shall we? Everything we've talked about. Bro, I've never cared about, I don't care what rapper got at me, bro, ever. But, like, really, there's certain shit I've always, I really don't fuck with in my life, and I would never do. But, like, I got to sit here and act like, I know I'm in, I'm, in, I'm in America, I got to sit here and just act like I don't fuck with certain shit. I would never like it. My nigga's so angry right now, he would have cried. That's the type of angry. Like, right yo. Now. Yo, just please. I'm telling you, I I hate certain shit to to the soul of me. I, I can't. I, it, I'm only pretending because if I say want to. I want to say it, I will never be here for y'all. But that's not my content. But that's not my content. I don't want to be that person. I, I want to be the person who just have fun with y'all and some other shit. Now, Bay Squad, this is where it gets a little spicy. If you have children around, escort them out the room. Now, let's get into this mess. Now, the nigga we dealing with right now, pull up to your headquarters. 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 Niggas is in the streets. I want to meet in the road. Yo, headquarters. Nigga, what the fuck is somebody meeting you at your headquarters for? That's the problem. See, I think I'm starting to think that maybe this is your aesthetic. You do the fake internet shit and then you and you sit in a room full of motherfucking cameras and try to make a bitch crash out you know that's like we from the hood oh yeah that's like we tell the bitch uh-huh come in my house come in my house because i can do whatever i want to i went out for you don't have to me and you can meet we, we, we want to meet you outside i want to meet you outside i don't want to pull up to no motherfucking headquarters bitch corporate ass nigga i don't want to pull up to the motherfucking headquarters i want to meet you in the club i want to meet you in the field i want to meet you in the streets I want to see you outside. Let's get active. Headquarters. And I don't want to keep even pressing that we get on. We from the hood because we corporate too. We corporate too. Don't get it wrong. Bitches is cashing nice checks out this bitch. But we all know your motherfucking headquarters is giving 911. What's your emergency? Bitch, no. We're not doing that. We want to see you out the door, outside in the motherfucking field, bitch. Fuck is you chatting about? Fuck is you talking about, bitch? Botty man, bitch ass nigga. Nobody not pulling up to no motherfucking headquarters. Think this bitch work for McDonald's or something. Stop motherfucking playing with me, bitch. We want to see you out the door. In the streets, in the field, in the streets, in the club. Yeah, somewhere, somewhere. Where, let, 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 let's get it on, bitch. That's what the fuck we want to do. Bitch, and after I beat you, I'm going to fuck you in your ass. You a bitch ass nigga. That's what we do to you. I don't want to keep even pressing that we get on. We from you always motherfucking pressing a BBL, fag. Bitch, you sit on your thick ass. Bitch, you a, I got a BBL, bitch, and you a BBW. That's what you do. You big, you big, you a big black woman. That's what you is. Sitting on that motherfucking couch, chatting your motherfucking gums all motherfucking day. Popping shit like a hoe. I, you always talk about a BBL, but you sit on your thick ass all day. You a motherfucking stallion to me, bitch. Actually, you're a motherfucking bull. You fucking blimp, bitch. Who the fuck is you playing with? Hey, I, I, I got a fucking head. Like, <laughs> you're a clown. You a clown. You a joke, nigga. You a joke. And you talking with so much aggression and hostility behind a computer for a nigga that we don't see. Ooh, and child, this is crazy. And at the end of the day, I want to be like super empathetic to DJ Act, but he's not a good person. He's not a nice person. And I quite frankly do not care because of how he talks to black women. The only thing I can say is go press charges. Go press charges if you really feel like that because, baby, those were threats. And I wouldn't take those lightly. You see there? I gave you some advice. At the end of the day, when it comes to content creators versus celebrities, you do have to watch how you talk. Even when you are on your P's and Q's, somebody will pop out the Woodward's talking about suck my D-I-C-K. And if you don't believe me, you better ask Joe because we was over there swinging and banging against T.S. Madison. And nobody cared. They sided with the genetic man over the natural born women so when it comes to male on male violence baby 
you better keep your fist up and you better keep the protection on lock, okay? This is the same man who laughed at young Miami being shot at. This is the same man who incited violence amongst women. So I'm just looking at him, uh, survival of the fittest. Saucy, that was not right, but it's okay because you know what? Are they going to do something to you? Are you going to get canceled? No. So DJ Act, there you go. And on that note, what do y'all feel? How y'all feeling in the comments? Comment down below. I got to go. Bye, hoes.